my journey of activism began when I was like pushing the gender activism uh, way forward. And it all began when I realized that the gender activism is uh, interacting with the climate change activism. The Global Platform um, collects youth ideas. It collects youth from different parts of the countries. I want to know more and I also want to share what I get with the community that I come from. We plant trees with the children, we do beach cleanups with the children. We have to tell them that whatever is happening on the environment is due to climate change. Climate change has affected Tanzania in a very big way. When you take Tanzania for the past years to today, it's quite different. As you know, Tanzania, we depend much on agriculture. Most of the people are farmers. So the farmers, they also contribute. Most of the farmers are located in the rural areas. So we, the urban area, depend on the rural areas, which means if there is challenges in the rural areas, there is also a challenge in the urban area. We have to push the two agendas forward. First, to advocate for women's rights, for gender equality, but also to, in, to, in, to ensure that whatever we are doing is associated with the environment because most of the women are affected with the changes of the environment. In the global platform, different people come. As a youth, what do you have? What is your agenda? What is your idea? We collect them together, we present them to the right place. Across the globe, the youth are more, which means our voices is more stronger if it's all united. So if the youth stand together, get united together, we can push any agenda that is very impactful to the environment that we live, very impactful to the society. Because if we stand together, it's likely we are going to achieve the goal together. I wish to see women standing forward with a very confident means. My call to action to youth is to change the climate narrative into action.